In Australia's first fertility census, we uncovered many surprising facts by crossing the country and asking adults young and old to open up about their sex lives. First of all, did you know our average Australian is having sex nine times a month? And unsurprisingly, those aged between 18 and 24 enjoy sex nearly 50% more often. Then, perhaps as life starts to get in the way, the average drops to seven and a half times per month for people aged between 45 and 50. And if you want to boost your average, we suggest you head to South Australia, where on average, they enjoy 11% more sex than the rest of the country. When it comes to fantasies, 62% of men and 65% of women confess they simply thought about their partner during sex. And the rest? Well, women were 81% more likely to think about Australian Chris Hemsworth than Oscar-winning George Clooney. Cliché or not, we also discovered men were 15% more likely to want to go straight to sleep after sex. Yet, men can also be swept up in the moment, being 16% more likely to want spontaneous sex when trying to conceive. We also asked people about their perceptions on the best position to conceive and found 72% of women believe it is when they are on the bottom. Whereas men were 70% more likely to believe that consulting the Kama Sutra was the key to success. The truth is, there is no evidence one position is better than the other when trying for a baby. If you are trying, here's a couple of things you may want to know. The timing of your sex each month is of the utmost importance. Our ovulation calculator can help you understand the best time for you. The length of time you try is equally important. If you are under 35 years of age with no known medical conditions, trying for up to 12 months is acceptable. Whereas if you are over 35, try for up to six months before seeking assistance. And if you know you have genetic abnormalities or a history of conception issues, or perhaps wish to take your first step and have some testing, speak to a fertility advisor. Don't worry, a simple phone call or meeting doesn't automatically mean a fast track to IVF. In fact, at Janea, 50% of people we talk to do not end up needing IVF to have a baby. If you have any questions about fertility, talk to the experts whose science and technology have helped bring over 800,000 babies into the world in the past 28 years. Talk to Janea.